Hello everyone and welcome to our channel. In this section, we will talk about the success stories of some of the most accomplished African entrepreneurs. There is an abundance of amazing business opportunities in Africa and our goal is to inspire you in your own entrepreneurial journey. But before we start, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to click the bell icon to be notified for future videos. In today's video, we're going to talk about William Kamkwamba, the young prodigy and inventor of a windmill and solar pump in his village to exploit a source of drinking water in the area. Born in 1987 in Doha, William Kamkwamba grew up in a small village in Malawi, surrounded by his parents and five sisters. He is the only boy of the siblings. His father is a farmer and young William often helps his parents in the fields when he is not on the benches of his school, Wimbe Primary School. When William was 14, Malawi suffered a severe famine. The Kamkwamba family could no longer afford William's school fees and he was forced to drop out of high school. During his stay at home, William Kamkwamba set up a small business to repair radios. He also worked with the village librarian to stay engaged in his studies, especially science. Working from a photo in a high school textbook using energy, William explained how to build a wind turbine that produces electricity from spare parts and scrap metal, despite the lack of instructions. Thanks to the books borrowed from the library, he discovered the sciences and in particular, the power of windmills to pump water and therefore irrigate crops and bring electricity. He then decided to build one. He then built a wind turbine to light the family home and power electrical appliances. It is from bicycle parts and different collected materials that he builds the wind turbine. Soon after, William Kamkwamba built another wind turbine to irrigate his parents' fields. Subsequently, the young man installs a solar pump in his village to exploit a source of drinking water in the region. William Kamkwamba's actions are sensational. His multiple projects bring many visitors, first the neighbors, then he will be invited to a TED conference in Tanzania in 2007 and a second time in 2009. Subsequently, he attracted the attention of the press. William Kamkwamba gained fame in his country and his story was told by the international press. The Malawian is then invited to entrepreneurs' meetings where he presents his projects, his presentations in press, and several venture capitalists have pledged to help fund his high school education. William Kamkwamba became a student at the Christian Academy of African Bible College in Lilongwe. He then received a scholarship to the African Leadership Academy and in 2014, he graduated from Dartmouth College in Hanover. William later became an entrepreneur and began working with the design company IDEO.org and the Wider Net Project. A strong supporter of the power of human-centered design and an experienced farmer, William has been a consultant on agricultural technology development projects in Myanmar, public sanitation solutions in India, and support for victims of gender-based violence in Kenya. In 2013, he was the subject of a documentary film, William and the Windmill, that won the Grand Jury Prize for Best Feature Documentary at the South by Southwest Film Festival in Austin, Texas. In the same year, the Malawian was named one of 30 entrepreneurs under the age of 30 to change the world. Elected to the Sphinx Senior Honor Society, the entrepreneur also co-authored the book The Boy Who Harnessed the Wind with American journalist Brian Mueller. William co-founded the Moving Windmills Project, which enables young Malawians to implement simple technologies that make everyday tasks easier. Currently, William is designing an innovation center in Kasangu, where young people can find the tools and mentorship to increase crop yields and lead safer lives. Since then, the young entrepreneur has been touring the continent and other cities around the world. Its goal is to convince young people to create. For him, 
It is important to base himself on his difficulties to innovate. William Kamkwamba's inequity is still at work. He has also built water pumps and wind turbines in his country. His obsession is to offer poor populations access to drinking water and electricity. According to Forbes and Business Insider, William Kamkwamba's net worth is approximately $1.5 million. So guys, that concludes our video about William Kamkwamba's story. If you want to learn how to explode your online revenue with the power of digital marketing, click on the link below to sign up for our accelerated training. Give us a thumbs up and see you in the next video. Until then, keep smiling.